Hi and welcome to my channel. Um, today I'm here with my student TC and we're going to be going over Nahanchi technique. Now remember, if you're training in Nahanchi or any kata, your kata really should be looked at as an entire system of martial arts. So uh, we're just going to be using a couple of basic moves here. I'm using our outside strong block. Okay, so TC is going to be punching at me. I'm, I'm here. He punches again. I switch here and I go towards the neck area. Okay, now I can wrap around and finish him. Now, <clears throat> I'm going to do the move and TC is going to do it. You're going to do that move. Okay. Now see how we trap my arm. Okay, now we're going to do it this time. I'm going to block. So he comes here. He comes here. I block. He uses this to trap my arm and then come in and strike. Let's take that from another angle. So I'm throwing a punch in at him. He blocks. I come right in here. I blocked or I struck again and he strikes. That time he used it to stop a, a second, a third strike. So now I'm going to punch in. He's coming in here. This time I just block. He's going to use that elbow, pivot on my arm, trap me by pressing down here and then following up with an elbow. Notice his position. He's in position to where he can uproot me by breaking my stance, by going through my legs, okay? So position is very important in this. If at the time I go to throw any kick, he just simply moves in. So let's do this again. If I went from here to throw any kick, okay, all he's gonna do is continue the motion forward and I start falling back. Well, thanks again for watching the Zankwack channel, and uh, take a look at my other channel, which is going to deal mostly with these Nahanchi moves. I'm going to stop placing a lot of Nahanchi stuff mostly on my Nahanchi channel called The Nahanchi. So take a look if you get a chance, and subscribe to my Nahanchi channel also. Thank you.